Just got the sound check, and this is where we're at. Look at this. It's pretty cool looking. I don't know what those things are though. That's the stage. It's definitely Warp Tower esque. I'm gonna go on record saying there's few shows that like really stick out and this is going to probably be one of those especially considering we're like right here that just is such a cool view to be able to like turn around and actually see that from the stage I just want to go I just want to go hang out in there go kayaking I saw some people doing it earlier that is Danny we, we lost him for a little bit other one I remember shoot we played on the water another time and I can't remember do you remember the last time we played on the water it's like vaguely remembering it Oh, no, I mean like where the water was behind us like that, not to the side of us. I deserve that. I deserve that. I'm sick, man. I'm still getting getting over that. Is that a new Willie King song? I wrote it, yeah. Oh, good. It's called Bullet with Butterfly Wings. It's going to be a big hit in 98. <laughs> When you went to high school, right? Well, yeah, I was in high school. <laughs> it's otherwise known as tree chicken. <laughs> Put him in a taco, it's delicious. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Look at this, a baby dinosaur. I see something like this and I get blown away that birds are closer to dinosaurs than lizards. Go touch it. No. Happy Sorry. family baby shower. Sorry, I broke the Yep, good job. Happy, happy. <laughs> but my aunt is throwing us like a, a really cute, like just family based baby shower today. So we are gonna have a little get together and it's gonna be awesome because it's super beautiful here. The grandmamas are here. <laughs> Kayla and I have just been flooded. You guys remember in Tallahassee where they had the uh, RC car thing where we did so many of the jumps? They actually have one of those here as well. We got like, we got a few hours to kill. Figured we'd go play some tennis. And it's scorching heat. Feels like Warped Tour right now, to be honest with you. Literally that woodpecker is just destroying that wall right now. It has definitely been a very interesting day today. Danny, Travis, and I played tennis for I think about two hours and then we all just came back here and just passed out. It's It's been very hot. And uh, Coley, what do you think so far? What? So far. What do you think so far in life? In life? In life. I think it's going good so far. <laughs> so far life is good. We're dropping Danny off. The rest of us can go hit a mini mark. Sarah, uh, pick all right, up Dad. a little bit of gear. And then we're, the rest of us are all going to go back and hang out. Look at that sunset. That sky is beautiful. So, so nice looking. That's one thing that I have to say. When you're on like an island, the sunsets and sunrises are so amazing. That was a beautiful family get together shower. My aunt did an amazing job. I'm, I, I feel so blessed to that. So many family members and it was just a wonderful, wonderful time. And I, I, like I said, I'm forever thankful. Like I'm forever, ever thankful. Well, my sister's gonna throw one for me. Um, that's like a lot of my friends. So like the girls from the band and a lot of my friends obviously around here, some of my best friends and we're gonna do kind of like a girl stay at her house. So it's a little bit more laid back. It's a little bit more casual. I'm very, very excited. Like I'm super, super, super excited about it. My aunt just did one for the family. So it was a little bit, it was just, it was a little bit more casual, a little bit more intimate. And I really appreciated that. It was really wonderful, but I can't believe it. First baby shower down. 
I can't believe Caitlin's gonna give me another one. And uh, the next thing you know, baby's here. It's crazy. So here's the deal. I don't know if you guys have noticed today, I've been kind of a little bit, I'd say a little bit off, I'll be honest. As you probably saw from yesterday's video, I uh, found out, no one got hurt, but it's, it's still messing with my head. That whole plane crash, our plane that crashed just after we got off, and we had all that maintenance issues and the fact that it like i don't know if I, I did think i did tell you like when it landed we even were like thinking like this is this isn't right this is still going so all day today it just kind of it was messing messing with my head so much because i kept thinking about like how life is life is so precious and like thinking about i talked about about yesterday but like like all day today i have just completely been out of it like every time i do something i it, what i'm trying to say is i really kind of it was an eye-opening experience because it made me really kind of start cause i complain about the stupidest things sometimes you know with youtube or some other stupid thing i definitely that kind of like woke me up a little bit being like why why does it matter in the long run why why are you why do you care so much because i think about you know ally i think about my family i think about my little baby girl you know coming and then my head goes into a dark dark area and kind of freaked me out a little bit and all day i just been kind of blah didn't want to do anything didn't want to pick up the camera barely went out and i think we played tennis for like an hour and that was that was pretty much it. I didn't want to... It sounds like really dramatic. I know, it sounds super dramatic, but... It's... And then on top of that, I think... I just think about like... This is actually kind of crazy to think about because I am so, so, so happy all those people are okay because I remember getting off the plane and talking to a stewardess, two of them, and how they were apologizing to me about the air conditioning. And I'm just... I was just like, oh, it's not your fault. You know, it's a bit, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm like, it's not your fault, unless it is. You know, just joking around. And then I started thinking, like, thank God nothing happened because I feel like that would haunt me forever. You know what I mean? Like, that stupid little joke. I don't know, guys. It's I don't know if this is the kind of stuff that you've ever had those, like, near experiences like that. It's definitely one of those ones that just kind of really kind of shook. Are we ready to go? Yes, sir. All right, now we're gonna go play a show. So, gotta shake it off. Over and over and over and over and over a million billion times. Today was just amazing and I just, I feel so loved and my sister feels so loved and it was just such a wonderful, it was a really wonderful day and I just, so nice of my aunt to put it on and have family there and do this like little family thing. I like, I really liked that it was a little family thing. And now I'm prepping Caitlin's like friend baby shower. I know it sounds extreme and a lot of people are like, why do you need to? But Caitlin and I had originally planned on doing baby showers for each other and I told her that if she was gonna plan one for me I was like you need to try and emphasize with my friends no gifts I just want girl time like that's the biggest thing is like I want girl time for her I want to make sure I make it really special because it's really important to me to make it really special so it was just today was just beautiful all the baby showers are just so beautiful we got so many wonderful things silly this is a bunch of stuff for Caitlin's baby shower but I'm actually wrapping up some gifts for um, my friend's baby shower tomorrow. I'm trying to get that already because it's at 10 a.m. in the morning. I have to always say thank you to everyone, all my friends, all my family, like just everyone just really went above and beyond today. This baby girl is so loved. I can't wait to share everything with everybody. Baby girl kept me up all night last night. I think this is gonna be the routine for the rest of this time frame. Guys, we're so happy to be back. I really, I know, I know it's crazy that it's all, it was only a day away from you guys, but it was weird and we're just so happy to be back and we love sharing these moments with you. So. I'm gonna go finish wrapping. So this is where Ali's at home right now. Look at the sun right there. Or the light is still there. And then look at, this is where I'm at. Complete darkness, not so much. Pretty. Today, Ali had a joint, uh, ba uh, I wanted to say bachelorette party, but it was the uh, bridal, sh I just said it again, baby shower. baby shower. And obviously I couldn't be there. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to go, so Allie's showing me all the cool little like clothes and stuff that she ended up getting, or we ended up getting. Let me see the little romper one. This, so, there's like this little white romper from your mama and Melissa, and there's this little black one. I love this shirt, though. This is like one of my favorite shirts that your mom, Melissa, got, and it's like 
It's got dinosaurs, cats, dogs, rainbows, cupcakes, narwhals, everything on it. Look at it. It's just missing pizza. It's the cutest thing in the world. Our daughter is going to be the cutest little girl ever. She's going to be the best. Look how cute this is. That's adorable too. That is adorable too. Your mama. Your mama got this. See, this is, what, this is why the technology is awesome because I couldn't be there. I, you should have got me on FaceTime. I could have sat right next to you or something. Uh, they, they were going to FaceTime you. Next time, I'm going to sit next to you on FaceTime, just like in South Park. Well, hon, I got to go be, your husband's got to go be a rock star. Your husband is the coolest husband in the world. He's the coolest. Oh, guess what? You're gonna have your very first Mother's Day next week. That's, I'm not, that's weird. Your mother. Care. That'll be your first one. So were you actually gonna do something for me? Technically, I have to now. What are they calling? Drugs? You making the uh? You doing drugs? <laughs> <laughs> Classic. Classic right there. We haven't even put it out yet. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> Unreleased. New album. Seven. This you ready for it, buddy? Um, as ready as I'm gonna be, having never sang this song live before. The middle? Yeah. I mean, I know the song. Everyone, yeah. Everyone knows the song, but there's... Uh, this there's is the first difference. time we've ever played the song, right? If it makes you feel Just any better, it. I've never sang the song live either. Yeah. So. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> I got the choruses, I'm just, but you know, you gotta come out strong with at least the first verse. It just needs some time <laughs> everybody Woo! in the line. Sing it with me! <laughs> Just got done uh, with the, the show. Um, that The guy who you just saw like, uh, getting ready to play the middle, that's Thomas Ian Nicholas. I don't know if you guys recognize him. He's the dude from American Pie and uh, greatest movie of all time, Rookie of the Year. He crushed it, but it was, this, it was actually really rowdy. It's a really rowdy place. A lot of fun. This was, this is, this was a lot of fun. Um, definitely something that I needed uh, to kick me out of like last night or t t yesterday, like to old today. I'm sorry. It's been a long night. To earlier today, when I was like, you know, like messing with my head and everything, but it's a good way to end the night, that's for sure. Much nicer. Yeah, I, I just kind of wanted to reiterate how important, like what I was saying, because I don't feel like I said it like properly. I, oh my God, I'm so itchy. I feel like I have like, I don't know, some crawling on my arm. It's driving me nuts. Do you know, like when you have that itch and like, you got distracted? So what I'm just trying to say is, remember guys, life is precious. And at any moment, something crazy could happen. Like, that was definitely an eye-opening experience, for me at least. I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for enduring my stupid ranty face and all that 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 goodness. It was actually kind of cool to get to see what Allie was doing. I'm not gonna lie, a little jealous. I, I wish I was there. She did save a bunch of presents for me to open with her, which is kind of cool. I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. You guys, like I said that, I'll see you guys tomorrow because we have not the weekend. It's not the weekend, so I get to see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye. <laughs> I'm so itchy.